Shalom everyone, Chanukah Sameach, Happy Chanukah. Chanukah is the Jewish festival of lights and it's also the Jewish festival of education. Our sages tell us that the word Chanukah is connected to the Hebrew word Chinuch, which means education. This video is a journey of education, of understanding, and of song and spiritual growth as we're presenting Behind the Songs of Chanukah together with our new director of adult learning at Shara Shemaim, Rabbi Mark Fishman. This experience is a way to join you in your homes as you celebrate Chanukah and we connect to our spiritual home of Shar HaShemayim. Chanukah Sameach, Happy Chanukah. The songs of Hanukkah are beloved by all, yet oftentimes unknown in terms of both the lyrics, translation, and the historical backdrop. I'm here today with Cantor Zelemiah to sing the songs and to learn the history behind them. Cantor. Well, let's clarify first. You're here to teach the history. I'm here to sing the songs. That's absolutely correct. Tell me, do you have a few favorites? Well, one of the great things about Hanukkah is, of course, we have eight nights, which means there are lots of songs. And uh, in this case, we'll choose a few of them to maybe delve into, but I'd like to start with one in particular that's a fun one. It is Mi Yimalel. It's a great, fun round. It's often sung in a round in large groups of people. But, you know, can you tell us a little bit about the history of it? Absolutely. Mi Yimalel is... Uh contemporary song written by Menashe Ravina. He was a 20th century Zionist, and he does something rather counterintuitive. He takes one of the great verses of Tehillim Psalms, chapter 102, that says, who can possibly speak of God's greatness? God is so great, we can't even, impossible to capture that largeness. Mi Yimalel Gvarot Hashem. Who could possibly speak of God's greatness? And this secular Zionist, Menashe Ravina, flips the entire narrative and says, who can talk about the greatness of the Jewish people? This was a secular Zionist promoting secular Israel and the strength and power of Israelis to once again reclaim and recapture their land using their own force. God does not appear in this secular version of the Hanukkah song. And instead of Miya Malel Gvorot Hashem, Miya Malel Gvorot Yisrael. Who can possibly tell of the power of the Jewish people? It's a great point because Hanukkah is up there with Pesach as probably the most universally observed Jewish festivals. And in this case, it's not surprising to me that a secular Israeli de-deifies the message a little bit and makes it more accessible to non-religious community in order to be able to buy into the celebration of the holiday. Absolutely. So shall we hear it? I would love to hear a rendition. Well, we have lots of Hanukkahs at the Shar and we have lots of Hanukkiyot at the Shar. And here's a great glimpse of one of them, Mia Malel. Mi yimalel gvorot Yisrael otan mi yimne En bechodor yakum hagibor gohel ham Mi yimalel gvorot Yisrael otan mi yimne En bechodor yakum hagibor gohel ham Shav ayamim ha'em bazman Makabi Moshia u Fodeh, Ovi Amenu Kolam Yisrael, Yitachen Yakum Lehigael. Mi Yimalel Gvorot Yisrael Otan Mi Yimne, En Bechodor Yakum Hagibor Goel Ham. It was the fall of 2020. We were all in the throes of the early stages of the pandemic. Everything locked down, synagogues quiet, school tentatively on, tentatively off. And nobody knew what holiday celebrations were going to be available, both in the Jewish community and in the community at large. And I received an invitation from the Montreal Symphony, a beautiful invitation. They were putting together an online holiday calendar, an advent calendar for the secular holiday season, and they wanted to include something related to Hanukkah. 
So they invited me to come to Maison Symphonique downtown and record a Hanukkah song with the Montreal Symphony. And there is no more iconic Hanukkah song than what we sing immediately after we light the candles every single night of Hanukkah, Maos Tzur. What do you think of that? Moat Tzor is perhaps one of the favorites and most well-known of all of the Hanukkah songs, but little is known about the meaning. Moat Tzor is a historical perspective throughout the ages of different empires that attacked, enslaved, and physically tried to extinguish the flame of the Jewish people. And so stanza by stanza, we speak about the Egyptians, the Babylonians, the Persians, even Haman and the Purim story makes its way into Moat Sor until finishing with the battle against the Greeks and the favorite story of Hanukkah. Take a look and listen to this exquisite rendition of Moat Sor. Two small notes for you while you're listening to this performance. Number one, there is a North American version of Mao's Tzur, but there's also a UK version of Mao's Tzur. The ending of the verse is a little bit different. Tikon beit tefilati visham toda nizabeach. That's the common North American version, but the more beautiful I find version is the UK version. Tikon beit tefilati visham toda nizabeach. The other thing to note about this is that this is the first that I know of trilingual version of Mao's Tzur. We have the Hebrew, the English commonly no translation, Rock of Ages, and a singable French translation that was sourced from the synagogue on the Rue de la Victoire in Paris, specially for this occasion. Mao's Tzur with me and the Montreal Symphony.
popular Yiddish singer Moshe Oisha on his Hanukkah compilation finishes the album with Hoitza Guden Hanukkah. Here, a medley of popular lyrics taken from a variety of songs finishes with Nes Gadol Haya Sham. Of course, the letters on the dreidel, a great miracle happened there. Hanukkah is the story of miracles, but in order to see them, we have to open our eyes and realize that they're taking place always right in front of us. Nes Gadol Haya Sham, a great miracle happened there. May we see them, believe them, and be a part of them. To me, Moshe Oisher is one of the greatest performers, not just cantors, performers in all of the recorded legacy of Jewish music. He, from Eastern Europe, made his way to the United States, was a star of film and stage, and this is just a fun piece that encapsulates his inimitable style of mixing chazanos with jazz licks and and, and, and it's, it's just so exciting the way he mixes it all together. Hot agitn Hanaka nes kadol hayasha. Alla ni simi alla purka, ay 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 ay, vi alla kvuroi si alla chuoi, ay 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 ay, she yosi so la voseino, ay 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 ay, ma ya mi ma he bas manaze, ay 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 ay. Well, Rabbi, was that a fun tour? I loved it. Thank you. It's fun and for me too. I hope you've enjoyed this at home. Happy Hanukkah, everybody. Joyeux fête de la lumière. Hag Sameach. Hag Urim Sameach. <laughs>